what's up guys today we're going to be creating this crt tv effect if you like this effect then i'll leave the link to the preset pack in the description if you want some easy drag and drop presets there's 10 different presets to choose from and they're all customizable using the settings in the parameters so let's try and create this effect from scratch the first thing i'm going to do is bring in an adjustment layer so over here in my titles tab go down to adjustment layer and add in an adjustment layer over the top of my video so that we can add effects and stack effects on top of each other. Adjustment layers don't come with Final Cut Pro, but it's a free download, which you can get. I'll leave the download link in the description. You can also just add the effects to the video clip, but the results might change slightly. So let's go over to the effects tab over here and, and search up the sensor effect. And let's add this to the adjustment layer. This will pixelate the video clip. So if I drag the radius up here and then turn the amount to one, the next effect I'm going to add is the Gaussian blur effect and set this to about one or two as well. Next effect I'm going to add is the line screen effect. Let's change the angle to 90 degrees so that we get these horizontal lines. And then let's turn the scale of these lines right down to around about one and turn the contrast down slightly. And then let's add another line screen effect. And on this one, let's set the angle to zero and turn down the scale around about one and turn the stretch up slightly until you get a nice pattern that you like. Now let's go up to the color board here and turn up the saturation and add a bit of contrast to brighten it up. And then I'm going to bring in another adjustment layer over the top of this one. And on this one, I'm going to search for the fisheye effect and I'm going to add the fisheye effect to this. Change the amount to two and the radius. You could either bring it down so you can see the curved edges or you could bring it up to fill the screen. Now we get this nice swirling effect on the lines. And then finally, I'm going to add a glow effect. I'm going to use this glint glow effect. I'll leave the link to it in the description. It doesn't come with Final Cut Pro, but there are other glow effects that you can use. I just like this one because it has a lot more adjustments than the Final Cut Pro one. And there we go, that is the finished effect. We can always go back and change the settings on the line screen effect. If you turn up the scale on the line screen effect, then it will change the pattern of the stripes to get different looks. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Subscribe if you liked it, and I'll see you in the next one.